Good morning YouTube, Chris here, the Country Cottage Garter. I hope you're all well. I'm here on a job today, a fencing job. It's a job where we're taking out timber uh, posts, timber panels, and putting in concrete posts. The delivery should have been here at least 15 minutes ago. So I'm a little bit of sort of one of those things where you think, you know, the address has been checked and everything, so it's just one of those things that I'm sure they're just getting busy. Anyway, I've spoken to the client, they're very happy for me to be filming today, and uh, I just really want to crack on, so that's when we come around, we're going to have a little look at the job. So this is the garden in question. We've got 13 bays starting off down here. Now the fence going in is going to be concrete gravel boards. So we're going up in height slightly as well. So these are six foot panels. Um, I think if I remember rightly, some of these are in spurs. Come on, I have to be careful of this deck. That is well slippy. Um, but yeah, it's well and truly, truly had it. Um, I've got two days down for this. I can normally knock out six bays a day on my own with the old one ripped out and new one going in uh, but I am going to be missing out the old post holes so it's going to be hopefully virgin digging here um, I know that the ground sits extremely clay around here so that's pretty good because we had rain yesterday as well the slightly concern that we've got <coughs> that silver birch over there that the roots might be something to be thinking about there uh we've got the patio here not sure what's next door but because we've got half a bay down the other end i'm going to start with a half bay here and then go to full ones so on so forth got some tools out gonna to get some more tools out and hopefully be the fencing guys and get some out before they they get here which is fine so but anyway let's crack on hope you enjoy the video Oh, right, I thought I'd just better log in with you. I've uh, 
been powering on, if I'm honest. Let's just come down to your level. So, that's better. Right, so, one, two, three, four. I'm about to do my fifth bay. Normally I bay six a day. And we are half past 12. So I'm not doing too bad for time. It really helped with um, giving the delivery driver a tenner and helping him, uh, getting him to help me bring stuff around. Always keep good to keep people sweet like that. Um, fencing, yeah, it's a two person job, but I'll tell you what, I can be productive on my own, but it's far easier on the body and doing the job sometimes um, when you've got two people. But the ground's been kind so far. Touch wood, it's going to continue. I think I'm going to have something to eat. The, the customer's been absolutely fantastic here, keeping me topped up with coffees, which is really nice. It's nice to have good hospitality. Oh, I've got crud in my eyes. But anyway, have something to eat. Take out the rest of those, although they are falling down. I've just gone and undone all the screws. And, uh, yeah, crack on.
strange that you do those things, you think, oh, that's annoying, and yet you don't do anything about it. That's uh, one of those really silly things I know, but that's how I try and break things down in business as well. If there's something annoying, there's something that you don't like, try and change it within your actual, your actual business working. Anyway, just uh, cut the final one slab where I put the first post in, because we've upgraded from 75mm to 100mm posts. Just had to take a little slither out. But anyway, let's swing the camera around, we'll have a chat about the job and you're going to have a look at the final finished product. Here we are. So over here is the first one I put in and I had to just nick a little bit off there. That isn't actually a full panel, that's actually had uh 26 centimeters i think cut off it so we've got one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen and a little bit of base so this is feather edge um stepped it up slightly here because the rest of the run carries on um, stepping up into the neighbouring garden. If you remember the small panel was here so I've missed it and I've done new ones there and to be honest because the client has bamboo and everything in that corner it's more hidden it makes the garden you know it's more consistent really having the three big bays there and the smaller one and it worked really well for me. So this one Confession time, I was a little bit short with my calculations. I had to go off and get two pails, and this has got a little cut in it. It's not damaging the function at all, um, but that's got just a little bit in there, but that's not too bad. The client's happy about it. So I had to nip off and get two pails. This is why I always keep things. I already had some of this top rail left over from another job, and some of the back rail, so I just nipped off and picked up two of those. I put a timber corner post in there because if I'm honest the concrete ones are so heavy um, they're like 120 odd kilo um, and that would have been a three-way so I think that's even more even heavier so as it's an interconnecting one the client was more than happy for me to put a timber post in there and I'll be honest because we've got the concrete one here it's not really going to make much of a problem in the future. So there we are. Six inch gravel boards, six foot fence panels. Um, and it's taken a day and a half on my own. <coughs> Just had my chap come and collect the waste. Um, they've done all the wood and they're going to come back for the hardcore and a few little bits tomorrow because they've got soil run through but this is the run this is all of the spoil which has come out as you can see where the end post concrete was so that's one post that's quite a lot of post creep for for one for one post that's a heck of a lot of concrete so I, I have no hesitation that this job would have rolled on to three days if I hadn't done the old skippy do of missing the concrete and what have you but there we are that's all completed i hope you enjoyed the video and if you haven't liked subscribed please do so and we'll catch up with another one soon cheers